Luke here with a Settlers of Catan update. Many people might be kind of confused because Settlers, or Settlers, I don't know how people say it, uh, of Catan is a board game, but it's really, really fun on Xbox, and it's actually a game that I play all the time by myself uh, when not doing um, Luke's Arcade stuff. So I thought, you know what? Let's do this. I want to put this on Luke's Arcade. I want to teach you guys how to play. If you know how to play Settlers of Catan, I promise you will like this. Uh, you will like this type of video. If you don't know how to play Settlers of Catan, I will do my best to teach you how, uh, how to play. But um, honestly, you're going to get confused. It's like any watching anybody play a board game. You know, if you sit down and you're looking at the board and you and you want to know what's happening, um, you're just gonna get confused. So this video might not be for you. It's kind of like when I played League of Legends that one time. Um, anyways, oh, it looks like I'm already in a game. Oh, Workaholic has a really good record. You might want to like, you can actually go back in the video and see like their win and loss. Cause I'm playing against some of the people online right now. Okay, so I'm gonna do my best. This is, this is like a legit, um, online game, and, oh, that's a really good starting spot. Oh my gosh, they're really, I, I go next on choosing a spot. Again, if you've never, oh, he did, that was such a good spot for him to take. Um, again, if you are new to this, oh, that is a fantastic, Joey, which spot should I take? Should I take the, the brick? Should I go try to be brick, or should I try to do... Uh... Oh, that's such a good spot. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take this one. And I'm gonna go that way. Oh, somebody's already quit. The blue player up here already quit because they're like, nope. Um, so that's a computer. Sansui is a computer. San I almost said like Sam Sui, the singer. Uh, Sun, Sun Sui, Su, Sun Su is probably actually how you say it. Um, so now it's pretty much like Haran and versus Workaholic. Now it's coming back to me. Where do I want to go? Ooh, that's a really, that's a really sexy looking spot right there. I could probably go there. Where do I want to go, Joey? This is all timed as well, so that's why I'm kind of stressing out. So that would give me more sheep but I'm I'm gonna be so screwed for brick oh do you know what I could take that eight the ten, eight, ten. Yeah, I get that. should I get that yeah. oh my gosh the the yeah uh, or down to the question mark oh my gosh and then you'll have two I, well no 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 and I'm gonna have oh, I'm gonna be or king right now you and see you that buy a brick port up there. I know this is this is good okay and I also kind of uh, well, oh, white's still choosing. Well, you don't have wood, though. Well. Yes, and wood is actually really dry. We have term terms thing. Okay, so something you can look at is the numbers on here, and that shows how valuable each, like, point is. Man, there's just, like, literally absolutely zero time for me to explain this game to you guys. What the heck was that? Okay. Something's happening very quickly. Okay, so I just get to move the robber right away. And honestly, this is one of those one of those games right now where um, oh, he's he's sad. He doesn't look that I, like that. I just did that. Joey, should I try to get that ore port right away? I think that's what I'm no, gonna do. No, no, no. Where should I go? Where should I go? Bottom, bottom or do you think? No, no, no. I think I should try to go work towards this uh, nine four two spot. You see that? Beat, beat red? I'm gonna do that. I know. But I stole that wood. Uh, so, okay, I got a six. So there's sheep, we have, we have brick. So he wants to trade. I, so there's a big thing of trading in this game as well. Um, so that's ore, he wants to trade ore for wheat he wants wheat pretty badly but that's not gonna happen okay so we just rolled a 10 so that means I get a sheep and an ore so 
Big thing in this game is early, you want wood and brick, because wood and brick will give you roads, and then you can travel all around the map to do something else. Man, what is this guy? He's just moving like so quickly. He wants to give ore. What the heck? This, this guy's really weird. Workaholic, the feed me guy is crazy. And his score was insane. Um, so what's my plan? What's my plan right now? I kind of want... Okay, so he wants that. I wonder what he's willing to give. Let's see what he'll give up for this. Oh, he'll give up wood. That's really good. I need wood. So, Sun Tzu uh, is a character that really likes ore a lot. So, since I'm getting ore like crazy, I can try to maybe try to get other cards from him. Um, okay. So, wood and brick uh, give you... Oh, please don't put it on my plot! Okay, good. He didn't. Oh, I want to do that. I want to do that. Yes. Okay, so I'm making a trade with him. Nice. I'm okay with getting the computer on my side because then he might like attack the other sides or, or whatever. Um, so again, blue is computer, red and white are actual opponents. But yeah, this, this game, it operates exactly like the board game. Um, and I just, I love the board game so much, but, uh, I, I want to win this. I want to win this a lot for you guys because this is the <laughs> first time of me putting something like this online. So what we need to roll right now is we need to roll an eight. Oh, what does he want to trade? Wheat for sheep. Do I want... No. I don't want to give up any more sheep, do I? I wonder why he wants um, sheep. Man, so here are the rolls. No eights have been rolled yet. Oh, that's no good. Because I need... Okay, he wants brick. Let's see. Maybe he would want uh, wheat. I'm just trying to get the best deals out of this guy possible. But do you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna buy a development card. Oh my gosh, I just got road building. Like, could not be a better development card to get right now. Early in the game, road building is like, by far the best. Please don't put it on the eight. No, he won't put it on the eight. Oh, no, he stole from me. He stole my wheat. Oh my gosh. Dang it. Okay. So, there is a little bit of patience in this game, and I am I can almost guarantee most people that don't know how to play this game have left. Uh, I can get a little bit competitive in this game as well, so if you're still hanging out with me, that means you probably know the game. If you don't, uh, then that means that um, you're just have nothing better to do than watch a game that you've never even seen. Game is interesting, but if you don't know what you're doing, um, then it can be kind of weird. So the object of this game is to try to get to 10 points first. Each one of the little houses out there um, represent a point. Um, if the house is a big house, that's a city that's two points. And so basically you start the game with two points. You try to get to 10, whoever reaches 10 first wins. Uh, you can get two points for having the longest road and you can get two points for having the largest army. Again, never played the game. It's gonna be confusing as F to you. <laughs> um, so, uh, let's, see what, let's see what he's going to four. My big numbers right now are eight, 10, nine, and five. So threes do not help me whatsoever. Oh my gosh. I didn't need an eight, like so badly I need an eight. Um, I just really don't want red to move to that spot. Oh, do you know what I could do? I could totally secure this this plot. 
Okay, I'm, I'm securing that wheat plot from that guy because I don't want him to build up there and take that point because he has a lot of cards in his hand. So he could uh, take, oh, I just got a, I just got an ore, or we say coal sometime. So he wants to trade wood. That wood card that I have in my hand right now is incredibly valuable because if you look, my houses, I can't get wood. Wood is like, it's, it's very hard for me to get wood, which sounds super sexual. Very hard for me to get wood. Oh wow, he's willing to give up two sheep for one wood. Um, so, coal for a sheep? Uh, it's not a bad trade. It's not a bad trade. You know what? Oh, he... Okay. So the computer can be kind of a jerk sometimes. And I'm on, like, his side. Like, what is this guy doing? Oh my gosh. Oh, wood for three sheep. What the fu... With this guy. So I can, I can hit Y, and that cancels... Um, it says, it basically, as if I'm sitting at the table with everybody, and I say, no. Like, I'm not trading with you. So the computer is being stupid right now. Really, I'm gonna roll a two. Ugh, terrible. Two uh, gives nothing. Oh, that, oh my gosh. So red really needs wood as well because there's only been a few nines rolled. Actually, probably only one nine roll. Look at that, what he's willing to give up. What he is willing to give up for wood right now because what does he want where does he want to go like what is it what does he need that wood so badly for what is he even gonna do uh oh white i think sees me as a threat sees me as a threat you're gonna put it on the eight. Oh, put it on the two put it on the two please please put it on the two no i knew it no please don't put it there oh my and gonna steal from me of course and stole my wood I'm throwing a fireball at that guy hey, look at that he 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 Wow man what a jerk what a jerk please workaholic maybe if you throw him a heart or something I throw him a heart maybe he'll trade with me look he's just laughing because he knew that I just totally screwed me. Well, if I get the opportunity, oh yes, ha ha! Put it on his six. Ha ha! They're all he he heing because I put it right back on his six. I'll be I'll be happy. I'll do a little happy emote with that. That's funny. So now I just need to get some rolls. Like, please start rolling my numbers. An eight, yes. Do you see that? I just got brick, which is like, I needed brick so badly. But now the the trouble right now is that I I have no wood. Like, I can't I can't get wood. Um. So I'm gonna have to figure out either a way to trade for wood which this Sun Tzu guy, like, really needs wood. Coal for wheat, I'll do that. Oh my gosh! Why is this guy being such a jerk to me? Um, he, like, won't trade with me. So what I could try to do also is get a city, which would be pretty nice. So he wants wood. Everybody wants wood. Because the only way to get wood right now on the map really is like a four or a nine. And those have not been rolled really that much. Eight. Another brick. That's good. Why are they all like hee hee heeing? What the heck? Okay, so this guy is like going nuts. Trying to get the best trades. Oh my gosh, just like abusing the computer. Hardcore. Oh, white, that was a really bad place to put. Look, he put it up on the 12. He got the three for one port. Like, yeah, that's cool, but oh my gosh, and now the computer won't trade with me. It's like, like what the heck? Please, I want a wheat. I want wheat. 
Anybody. See, this game, it gets like this. It gets like this. I take the smallest lead. Oh my gosh. He rolled a 12. Like, how could that even be a real thing for him to roll a 12? 12, 12 is the least rolled twos and twelves. Seven is a little bit more commonly rolled. Um, what does he want? He's doing ore for sheep. Wheat for a sheep? No. I don't have any wheat. Oh, so he's doing four for one trades. You can do that if you ever have something, uh, a lot of something. You can trade four for one on your turn. The three for one, the question marks, uh, give you more on uh, three. Three of anything for one on your turn. Oh, Monopoly, please don't take my co- Oh, he took all my ore. <laughs> oh, you guys, this game could not get worse for me right now. Jiminy Christmas. Jiminy, as Ingrid would say. Well, it's not looking too hot for me, this match. I think it's because they saw me, like, kind of... Uh, screw over red a little bit so there we go at least I got a wheat right now hopefully Sun Tzu-y, some Sun Sun Tzu gets uh, oh, a wood by chance maybe he did no I don't think he has um, and then he doesn't need it and he'll trade it up to me but right now for some reason I don't think he likes me Whenever the computer doesn't like you, which I didn't think that it was happening like that, they don't trade with you. And oh, now this guy's just being obnoxious, running the timeout all the way through. All right, eight more brick. Oh, it's like I didn't, I needed brick so badly earlier. The wood, please. Oh, the computer just will not trade with me. How does nobody need brick? How does white not need brick? White, you need brick. But you're just not trading with me. So I'm just gonna have to end my turn again. This is just not, not good. So how are you guys doing? How are you doing? Another brick! I get another brick. Oh my gosh. So he does need wood right now. The computer needs wood. I'm saying no. Oh, what the heck? He's like throwing fireballs at that guy. Maybe he's not actually a computer. Is that what it is? Like, no, he's he's operating like a computer. For two brick. No, we're all saying no. And there really has not been any... They're gonna do it. Three brick for one wood. So unfair. Like, the computer would not trade with me at all earlier. Okay. Computer could be an, a problem now, actually. Because he, he's getting two brick and he is on a brick port. So the computer is just dominating. Oh, I could get a wood here. Oh, you know what? As long as nothing bad happens... So, what the heck is this guy doing? As long as nothing bad happens right now, I might actually be able to... Um, look at this. Look at this insane trade that he's making. Oh my gosh. And white... Is, is this like a hack? Is he this guy hacking? Look at this! This is insane. Like, he's gotta be hacking somehow. Okay, so this guy's getting even more brick. Maybe there is a way to hack in this game. I don't know. 
Look, like he won't trade with me at all. Okay, so at least I can get another settlement here. All right, I have no cards in my hand, but at least I have another settlement. So I'll be picking up some stuff off of twos and fours now and double off of nine. Like, looks like nine's my number and 10, nine and 10. Definitely where it's at. Hmm, I wonder why, I wonder why all of a sudden the computer just like loves this workaholic guy. Like, it makes me think, it makes me think that if he is hacking, like, I'm not that, I'm not trying to be that guy right now, but, you know, I've never seen a computer throw a fireball at um, another player during their turn. It's like, you know, what the heck? Okay, there we go. Now the computer's doing something. Wow. So much brick. To buy a ton of development cards. At least, at least the uh, robber is staying on that guy in white. So he shouldn't be getting any cards, except for white right now seems to be the biggest threat because of these crazy trades that they're making. Are any of my numbers being rolled? Nines and tens are the least rolled right now. All right, I got a wheat off of the four. You know what I'm gonna do after this game? I'm actually gonna, I'm gonna see if hacking is available on, on a game like this. Because I see these people with like 200 wins and only 10 losses, and I just think like, how is that possible? On a game where like four people play, how in a world like could that be possible? Oh, this guy's not mad at me anymore. So let's see what he's willing to give up. I don't think he's gonna give anything. Anything? Oh, he'll actually give wood. Oh, that's really that's really good. I need to do that because I can get wheat, but I cannot get. Um, anything else okay oh my gosh this is like maybe light at the end of the tunnel right here because I just got the longest road which it's not necessarily that amazing for me to get right now but um, but it, it opens up the uh, port along the side see on the left there that coal port um, if I can get a settlement on that port, that means that I can do two for one trades uh, for coal for anything else. So I can't do anything else. Right now I basically just have to wait for their trading to be done. Because I don't have any cards. But I like sitting in, in this room to see what the kind of ridiculous trades the computer is giving up. Because just sometimes they will do that. Come on. What are you doing, computer? Again, like I said, you have to be a little bit patient sometimes. Especially when you go up against a computer like this. Some games are fast. Some games are just like the computer will take up an entire 60 second turn before they do things. Where's this guy even go? Oh my gosh, no way. Oh, he's moving down. He's gonna try to get my. that spot on the corner. Oh no, he can't. Where would he. Where's this guy even going right now? Okay, so to make a settlement, you have to have brick, wood, wheat and sheep. Basically every single card except for coal 
end, um, I'm kind of the coal king on this map. So, I need a two to be rolled pretty desperately right now. That did not happen, but I did get a wheat. Needed that. Okay, what's he gonna do? Hmm. What else could I what else could I get? Like it's usually a bad situation. It's usually a bad situation when you're like hoping for numbers that are not rolled ever. Like tens usually aren't rolled that often. Let's see how many times ten. Look at that. The numbers that I need to be rolled, nines and tens. The dark color in the back is how many times um they usually are rolled. And then above that is how many times they've actually been rolled. So where do I need to put this? I need to kind of shut down. Yeah, he didn't like that, but whatever. You have not been wanting to trade with me ever. I need wood. Please, not with you now. I guarantee he's going to just do that. Oh my gosh, not good. Not good. Soldier on the. Oh, uh, oh no! And then so he puts the he puts the uh, robber on me, and then rolled the number. Oh, maybe it's because he senses that I'm in such a good position. I really am. I feel stupid for saying. Oh my gosh, another twelve just rolled. Um. It was stupid for me to say that it was hacking because if he was hacking, the computer wouldn't just put a car or the robber on himself. So you can do little emotes in here. Like you can say, I've got nothing. That's what the computer just told him. Oh, another thing what people do in this that I've, I've noticed is that they will um, get a pretty decent lead and then just leave and then wait until all of their timers run out and that just maybe annoys people enough like if this guy doesn't do anything for the next minute it like possibly annoys the people that you're playing with enough that they just quit and like what an obnoxious way to play you know it's just like I would never want to play like that. Look at this. He's going to do it. Like, they just walked away. And they're just going to let it happen. Oh, last second. Trade. I mean, I'll make that trade. He's not going to trade with me. He'll trade with the other person. Maybe he feels bad for me. Nope. He's not going to do it. Oh, please. oh it's going to feel good to put this back on white. Take your stuff. I will take your stuff. Uh. Okay, what do I need? Nobody's gonna give me wood. Nobody's gonna give me wood. No. So now I'll just buy another development card. If that's a victory point, that's not good. Okay, so the different development cards. You have soldiers, which moves the robber around so that if you uh, have control over the robber, it's usually a really good thing because... Um, oh no. He, this guy just hates me. Like, I'm not even close to being out front. Maybe it's because I have longest road or something. Um, so yeah, whoever controls the robber, it's nice because um, then you, your stuff doesn't get stolen. And every time you move the robber, you can steal a resource from somebody else. Um, but... Another uh, development card is a victory point, which is just straight one hidden victory point. So say you have like eight public victory points, and then you have two private uh, face down development cards that are victory points. At the v you can show that. Wow, really? Like they they're just really not. Fe I'm not feeling good about this game. So many people just like taking my stuff white and blue hate hate me 
but I had a soldier, so I moved it. Oh, I got a wood, yay! But I don't have anything, I can't make anything with just a wood and a sheep. So now I need this eight, got it. And then if they roll a nine, nine would be really good for me right now. Um. Okay, what is he want? Okay, so he just played your plenty. Oh my gosh. The computer is taking a very commanding lead right now. Um. So I need a nine or a four. Nine would be good because then I get two wheat. And then I'll open up the, the sheep port, or the coal port. And then if I start rolling like fives and tens all day, um, especially tens. I don't like it that red has that city over there. I don't know. Are you kidding me? Oh, I got my four too. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay, so seven yes oh please please oh good they so every time you roll a seven if you have more than seven cards in your hand you have to discard so they just discarded a bunch of cards i will try to steal sheep back from him sheep yes i got it ah f you mother effer trade what can i what will you give me for this what will you give me for this nothing Oh, okay. I got it. I got it, though. Guys, I like. I got lucky. I got lucky because now, if if they roll a five right now, I, ba I basically get a wild card. So, um, what that means is that um, I get two coal for every five. No. Why? Why, why, why put it on that so much? I guess I understand. Oh, there's the five. So that means that I just got a wild card because I can, on my turn, trade those two cards in for anything that I want. Um, and late game coal is really good. So that's why I thought I had such a, a command on this game. Like I thought I had really good positioning. Maybe that's why they thought they had really good position, or they knew that I had really good positioning. And so that's the reason why um, oh, there's an eight for the wood. Yeah, look at that. He's hee heeing because he knows. Okay, that's not bad. Maybe, maybe if if I can get a sheep, I want sheep. Okay, how many sheep will you give me? He's not gonna give me much. God, that guy's such a jerk. Okay. So, now what I can do is I will get this. So I'll get another development card. Another soldier. So I can, mostly with the development cards there are more soldiers than anything. No, I literally have, have gotten every single soldier move that hasn't been on my turn. If he puts this on the eight, which he won't, which is good. Okay, nice, he had to discard a ton of cards and yes, that was good. That was good. It got off my stuff. He won. The computer just won. Oh my gosh. Fastest, dumbest. Like the computer just stomped us because they were playing dumb. Sorry if you guys don't like that. Um, I'm probably gonna play another game. So if you if you like this game, you should check out the board game because it's. Uh, I'd say the board game is like a little bit more fun than the, this game but I, I wanted to play this because it's just like it's a good time so thanks for watching and um yeah probably see you in another episode bye